desert. ¿Dónde estamos? Bear Valley. Oh, Esperia. Esperia, California. Mamá, me mata jugo. Dile hola. Saluda, amor. Saluda, amor. Hi, guys. No tengo mucho storage. I don't do that. So much wind. <coughs> See, I banyo. Holy crap! Thank you. No, that's not enough. That's a little warm, so be careful. Okay, thank you. We just bought some macarons. I've never tasted these before, so I'm excited. Hey guys, I was like falling asleep, putting Marisela to sleep, but I'm up. Well, I just took my eyelashes off, so yeah. But I'm gonna put together this this little thing oh, oh, for clothes because my sister just um, took all her stuff out of the closet that I told you guys about <clears throat> the one I told you that um, I'm like move I'm gonna move into so I'm so excited I was like already cleaning it my sister was like oh you're excited like yeah like, look at this. I'm so freaking excited. Maricela's clothes and then my clothes. And then, like, oh my god. I'm so bullshit. I'm so excited. So, yeah. I'm going to put together that little clothes rack. And I'm going to make it look all cute. And then I'm going to move into this room. And then I'm going to be so happy. Maricela's sleeping in there. Shush, shush, shush. shush. So I built my little thing. This is originally what I would use for my background. Um, like on my videos when I would do the black one. <clears throat> I just ran up the stairs so I'm tired. When am I not out of breath? But yeah. I'm going to put my cute clothes on there. I'm going to put the cutest clothes I have on here. So it can make it seem like I got cute clothes. No, but really. I'm going to get like the cutest clothes and cutest jackets I have on here. And cute colors for fall. And I'm going to decorate this all cute. So soft. I just got this, by the way. I got this from Winter today. It's only 20 bucks. So, I mean, yeah. Um, But, yeah, I'm going to have to order lights for when I make videos. Because the, the light is really dark in here. So, I don't know. It was time anyways. I have to for sure order my lights. Like, ASAP. I'm excited I'm excited I'm excited for this room so I was already in bed and everything and I've been needing to like I've been feeling nauseous for like two hours now and I was in bed and I came to the bathroom to throw up I don't know what's wrong with me it's like midnight it's literally midnight and I'm throwing up I don't know if I ate something bad. TGI Fridays, we had that earlier. It was not good. The food was not good. I'm sorry. It was so gross. Everyone, like my my mom hated her food too. I'm going to try to go lay down. Hopefully, I don't have to wake up and throw up again. Well, I wasn't asleep yet. I was so awake. Hey guys, I'm driving right now, uh, but I wanted to tell you guys really quick. You guys can probably already tell, <clears throat> but I used a freaking lip plumper. Look at this. Like, it doesn't even, <clears throat> my nose, it doesn't even look cute. 
like it didn't even plump my lips my lips are basically the same size they're just like red and the outer part is swollen I don't know if that was their goal for this lip plumper but I don't like it I don't think it looks cute I I've tried it twice already and even when I put on lipstick it didn't even look cute dang sorry about my pimple but yeah I told the company that I'm not gonna review it on my channel because I just don't like it it burns um, it's just uncomfortable for the first like I don't know 15 20 minutes <clears throat> and it feels kind of numb and it's just it doesn't I didn't like it so yeah I just wanted to tell you guys about that my lips don't look cute I thought they were gonna look plumpy and juicy but no uh, like I'm allergic to something it's just nasty okay so so far this is what I have um so this is basically all my clothes I'm still debating whether I'm gonna put more shirts in here or keep them in my drawers and then yeah but basically this is all my clothes that I have right now but ba I'm basically done organizing my clothes I know it's not that well color coordinated I'm like I don't know there's like a bunch of white with the blacks and there's like blue and then I don't know there's like some I don't know I don't know guys and then over here I put my jackets um and then I I have this right here so I just put some random pieces of clothing I have like they're basically all jackets and then this that I just bought yesterday um and I hung that there so this is basically all I have done and then when Maricela wakes up I'm gonna bring in her clothes and then put my stuff up there like shoes and bags and stuff like that and then I can put some shoes down there as well okay guys <clears throat> whoa I sounded like Darth Vader. Dark, Dark Vader, Darth Vader. I'm done. I'm basically done with. Oh, I already told you guys. I'm done with my closet. I just need to bring in all the other stuff. But Maricela is sleeping. She's been sleeping for a good, like, hour and a half, probably. So, thanks, boo. Um, and yeah, I just switched this desk, actually. I don't know. You guys probably don't remember the desk that was here before. It's this desk over there. Please zoom, zoom, zoom. Nope. You can't see it, but it was like white and red. And it was just, it's old. Hey guys. So, ugh, crazy day. Exhausting day. Um, basically, Maristela has a fever again. It's already 7 p.m. She's had it all day, but... I called her doctor in the morning and they didn't call back because <laughs> idiots honestly sometimes sometimes anything to do with like doctors and health and hospitals and all that they really fucking piss me off like <clears throat> I'm sorry no disrespect I know doctors save our lives but sometimes they just don't do their job like I don't know oh shoot I thought this was a cop but basically, she's had a fever all day. I don't know what it is. I know what you guys are thinking. What's wrong with this kid? They're always getting sick. I don't freaking know either. She was never like this. She never used to get this sick. So, I'm like, it's it's completely ridiculous, honestly. Um, uh, anyways, guys, yeah. We're on our way to urgent care. I just wanted to let you guys know what's going on and I just hope we get some freaking answers because this is completely ridiculous. I, I'm so tired of this and poor baby, I'm I'm sure she's she's tired too. Hi guys. What's up? Um uh, last time you guys talk well last time I talked to you guys was yesterday, so the last clip you just saw was yesterday. Today is the next day it's 11 30 p.m. I'm just so tired guys let me sit you down for a little bit and talk to you guys um it's just 
it's been a really hard day honestly earlier like I almost or I did tear up because it's just it's just so hard I'm so tired Maricela poor baby excuse my hair and stuff everything I'm just positive she's so tired of being sick too like no one can give us answers she's had a fever she's had stomach pain she doesn't throw up she doesn't she's had a little bit of diarrhea but I don't know at urgent care they didn't really help like they did a urine test and I don't know they always come up with some BS like literally sometimes I think all they want is money um but it's just it was just so hard today like like I said I started tearing up because it's just so much sometimes like it's just so stressful I know I need to I need to get rid of my mustache it's time it's that time um my brother tells me he doesn't tell me a lot but he's told me like he's like why are you so tired if you're just at home all day and because I'm always like oh my gosh I'm tired I'm so tired I'm tired I'm tired I'm always saying that and it's not that I'm physically tired it's not that I'm I'm tired like my body hurts it's not that I'm tired like because I'm working it's I'm tired up here like I'm tired in my brain in my head I'm tired mentally because it just gets so hard sometimes and it's so stressful like especially when Maricela's sick sometimes I just I want to do anything in my power to just cure her because she just gets so grumpy, she gets so cranky, and, um, I don't know, I, there's no way I can explain it to you guys. You guys probably think I'm over-exaggerating, but it's different, like, when you're dealing with it, and when you're dealing with it by yourself, you know? My camera cut me off, like always, I don't even know what I was saying, but basically, I was just telling you guys that it just there's no way I can explain it like you guys probably think I'm exaggerating and that I'm overreacting and it's just being a mom everyone does it and it's it's the easiest thing but it's really not <clears throat> especially when they're sick and Maricela just she won't even take down medicine anymore she's so tired of the doctor she w she wouldn't stop crying at urgent care yesterday because she's like traumatized last time they gave her an injection which those have like antibiotics and they hurt more than just regular shots they hurt a lot more so she's like traumatized she wouldn't stop crying yesterday and it's so hard just having to deal with that and watching her be like you know that scared and in pain she was throwing up her medicine today she threw it up her antibiotic now I had to skip a day because I can't I can't re-give it to her. Um, so tomorrow I'm going to try putting it like in liquid. It's just so many things you have to deal with that people have no idea. And like I said, just dealing with it on your own is just so much harder. Um, Daria was there yesterday at urgent care, but I'm talking about like at home and stuff, but... It's just really, really very difficult. And I'm just, like I said, I'm mentally exhausted. Like, my, my, it's just drained. I'm, like, drained. But, anyways, guys, I don't want to, sorry, I don't mean to be so negative. I don't mean, I don't want you guys to think that I hate my life and that I hate being a mom because you guys know I don't. It's just that sometimes it's just gets like overwhelming and you have these days you know not everyone's perfect we're all human we all have bad days um and on lately I've, I've just been trying to stay positive and I just posted on Twitter like you you it's hard it's hard to keep your faith when you're going through stuff like this um it's hard to not be negative it's hard 
to be positive and have a positive outlook on things when you're going through hard stuff but that's just what you gotta do you can't give up because if you do then you know what's the point what's the point of everything you've been through like you just can't give up you have to stay strong and I'm <laughs> being so cheesy right now but honestly guys you have to stay strong you have to be positive and you just have to you just have to deal with it and just remember that whatever you're going through in the end it'll make you stronger it'll it'll just make you so much stronger in the end um and yeah guys I don't want to ramble on too much because I gotta get editing for 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 the vlog channel and main channel so I got a lot of editing to do it's 1140 I don't know if I'm gonna shower tonight um, I'm just praying that money said it gets better by tomorrow because that's my main that's my main um, issue that's my main there's a word there's a word concern right now that is my number one concern I just want Maricela to get better um yeah my poor baby she's fast asleep right now thank god because she hasn't been letting me get up from the bed these past days she just wants me to lay down next to her which is relaxing for me I get to relax and just lay in bed but I gotta get to work I gotta get videos done I have to clean. I have, I've been organizing um, this room last time. I don't know what I showed you guys last, but I just ended up keeping that here. I took down like the poster. I still need to get this couch out. We need to get this bed out and get mine in here. We gotta get this out. And then let me show you guys my closet very quick. So I put my old mirror here and then this is the closet um so this is what it looks like i put some shoes down there this is my clothes and then i put some stuff up here and then this is my underwear and bra drawer and socks and then maricela's side is over here and that's her clothes um my shoes her shoes towels blankets and i still need to bring her um the clothes from her drawers I don't know where I'm gonna put them I don't know if I'm gonna keep them in the dresser so we gotta figure that out but this is basically what it looks like so thank you guys so much for watching this vlog